guys, welcome to another entertaining, exciting episode. Uh, in today's video, I'll be taking you through our school. I'll be showing you how our school looks like. If you've been watching my videos, you already know I teach in a school on an island. So let's get right into the video. Now, where I'm standing is the gate. As you can see, we have a very nice gate made up of uh, iron sheets and sticks. We can actually lock the gate. Yeah, our gate. So you come in like that. And then on my left, there is a... That's where we play. Volleyball, that's where we train. And then after training, we go for competitions and we keep everybody. So, <clears throat> Kiboge Primary School is a school in Homa Bay County, uh, Kibogi Island. Super south, and we are not so many, the population is not so high. So, because of uh, our population, we have to add in goats and a lot of birds. By the way, on this island, there are a lot of birds. I don't know what they are called in English, but then in uh, our international language, Lua, we call them or cock. The white ones are Whenever I have a new video, you will be the first to see it. Oh my god! Today it has rained. It has been shining. Guys, I have a cold, but I can put it. This is another class. Of course, you can see. Uh, look at this. Oh, this is where our kids learn from. But we appreciate the little that we have. There's a lot of sheets, obviously, because of the book. Uh huh. This is the uh, like one. Somebody seems to have overtaken the sharks. Yeah, but then you can see the depth. That board. There's only one wall. One day will be the one back. One day. So this is where we say this is where this is. Up here, we have the girls toilet. for you people. This is grade 5. 
and grade 4. I hope you can see it's one room that was divided into two because you don't have enough. Uh, yay, yay! Then, here is grade 6. So, I think this is the room that is visited by teachers mostly because this is where we love charging our phones. We use solar systems because there's no electricity around here. So you can see we have lots of batteries. We are very rich. And then we have the socket. So you plug in your charger and then you put your phone and then you have to wait for a while. <coughs> well, life on this island is not so easy. You just have to bear with what you have. Close it like that. The goats here are dangerous. They can even eat your phone. They are weak here. We are almost done, guys. Please don't forget to subscribe and like um, Grade 3. And then grade 2. Now, let me tell you something about this class. Come in, come in, come in. Come in. Say hi. Why you say hi? This is our senior teacher, my baby. So, before everything was made, all of us used to charge from here. So, one person at a time, and we'd make lines by the way. So, the senior teacher is overworking, as you can see, and the rest of us are just walking around and laughing. Forgetting to show you the staff room. Come let's show them the staff room. <laughs> oh, we have an amazing staff room. This is our staff room. As you can see, all of us have our own desks. Yeah? This is our staff room. We sit here. The table that I've just shown you, we put it here with the plastic chairs and we sit here. This is our staff room. So when it rains, we have a lot of trouble. Ministry of Education and the Minister for Education. This is the Minister of Education. So all our houses are made of iron sheets. We normally have visitors coming in, birds, snakes, all those things. At the back of the, our house, we have the bathroom. Now, I'm normally scared get you into this bathroom because a snake was once seen in here and I'm scared of getting in here because <clears throat> I'm normally afraid of snakes so I don't want to lose it. So this is the bathroom where I'm supposed to be taking my bath but I don't. Uh, in my next video I'll be showing you where I take my bath or my shower. <laughs> 
So after the bathroom, we move on to the toilet, the toilet. So, um, gents, gents, ladies. This is a ladies' toilet. We have three female teachers, but I'm the only one who decides in school. Now, let me give you a brief story about this toilet. When I was coming to this school last year in February, this is where I was supposed to be taking my shower. So it's a toilet, a luxury, as you can see. But then, this is where I was supposed to be taking my shower. The head teacher who was here actually made a lid that I was supposed to use to cover the whole while and am my bath. I think I used it for two days or so and then I decided to come up with my own bathroom. With my own preference. So, don't forget to like this video guys. For more content, for more interesting content about my life and my colleagues on this island, I promise you you will love our content. Is used by the men mostly. Two bathrooms, but then Madame Pachin doesn't use any. So, uh, this is our firewood. This is what we use to cook. I don't know what is going to happen to us today because they were rained on while we were in church. It's like we won't eat today. But then, that is the firewood we do here. This is where we will prepare our food. <laughs> Kitchen. Oh, look at them, Here's our kitchen. Our kitchen. Our kitchen. So, firewood, fireplace, lots of jelly cans, our surplus for the week, our vegetables. This is our kitchen, our utensils. That's it. So, uh, let me close it because the goats might come in and eat all all of our vegetables these are more houses for the teachers and then come 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 Jaro how are you? Good. that's a colleague of mine and uh, that is the end of our video for today guys I hope you've enjoyed the video please like the video give it a thumbs up if you liked it also comment below and tell me what you'd love to see in the coming videos bye guys mm -hmm.